Hey guys, it's Azor Knight, and I'm gonna show you today a couple of tricks, um, especially for sending your armies out. You wanna know how to preset. So to preset, you um, in the Rise of the Kings, you go to this flag right here. It shows you your total troops, total dispatches, grain consumption, and wounded. When you see where you see uh, troop details, there'll be a one and a two and I, th I think in like Roman numerals but uh click on the one um you could preset right now I got presets of 10 only 10 troops for like fake rallying presets is really smart so if you wasn't like in a rush you can send presets out of fake rallies or anything that you got saved instead of just um wasting time setting up your my, um your your um troops as far as a whole bunch of infantry or a whole bunch of arf, archers a little bit of catapults a little bit of uh cavalry well you can set that all up before you start a battle so you don't have to waste time so right now i have it set up for one only 10 troops so i put like one uh dragoon one crossman one heavy um catapult one axeman just like a real army is marching so because the enemy can't tell so I set it up as fake marches, and I sent three of these out so that they could think all my troops are out of ca out of my castle, and they will attack me. It's basically a bait tactic. So I preset um, these fake marches for ten, but this is basically how you preset. You could do a whole bunch of night, uh, uh, you know, a little bit of um, cavalry. And whatever before the battle so that way that you'll be prepared preset is really helpful in a lot of situations especially when you're in a rush i'm telling you it, it will save a lot of time and um your allies will think you're quick your enemy will think you're quick and everything you do and there won't be no mistakes there but um in the rise of the kings you could uh preset only two um marches um it should be more i think it should be more but two is all they got, well that's fine because before battle, like I said, you prepare yourself. Um and the end that's basically what preset does. Uh I could show you here that uh what my preset looks like, but I'm shielded. Well, I could show you on a monster. Um basically you could attack this. You click on preset one, it'll show ten troops at the bottom left. And you hit dispatch. That preset, it comes out your castle looking like a real march. So when I'm in battle and I'm about to attack somebody and my shield is down, it will show somebody's reinforcing me. Um, I guess he's giving me some. What he's giving me? He's giving me some uh, resources. Well, thank you. Um, so it looks like a real march. You got your. Um, the whole march just marching and it looks like you really sending a lot of troops to go fight something and enemies will see that but it's only 10 troops so that that would be a fake march you know you also could do fake rallies and stuff like that but that's a fake march and enemies think all your and when i do that three times enemies would think that all my troops are out of my castle and they will want to attack me but my troops are <laughs> all in my castle they're not out of my castle and it will it will catch them off guard because I did a preset of fake marches. It's a really good tactic. Um, if you're going to preset, uh, use this tactic. And if you want to go to war, preset um, your marches to what you need, what you really need. Like if you need a, a front line of infantry, probably 10% of your infantry, and then your whole back troops will be catapults or archers. You want to make sure you have that done before you go to war. So if you're about to attack, you won't be sitting there doing this. Um... I'm about to attack this guy. He has a whole bunch of infantry. Um, maybe I should send a whole bunch of infantry too to fight the infantry on the front line. Maybe a little bit of this. Maybe a little bit of that. Like it, it just wastes time, you know. So preset your uh, preset your marches and um, let's get it. Uh, thanks for watching um, this video. I hope that it taught you a little bit about presets and um, don't forget to like and subscribe.